All right guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're all having a great day. Now today, we're gonna be finally putting a new piece of glass in my window. Um, about a couple months ago, I ended up breaking my window to get into my car because my hood was locked and, or my car was locked and my battery died. So um, I ended up just breaking the window. Probably not the smartest idea, but I did it. And today we finally have the replacement glass and um, we're gonna try to put it in. I've only done one window before, so I'm not really the most experienced with windows. But um, we're gonna be trying to get this in today. All right, so first things first, we need to take this door panel off. And I'm pretty sure the way to do that is you take this out to disconnect all the wires. And then in these crevices, there's a little, these pieces of plastic pop out. So let's get those off. All right, so I got this piece off. And as you can see, there is a Torx bit inside there. I don't know if you can see, it's kind of dark. There you go. So we're gonna take that off and then try and get this piece off. I already tried and of course I cracked it because Volkswagen plastic sucks. But um, I'm getting, I'm hopefully gonna be um, taking all the interior pieces out that are tan and replacing them with black. But I have to get an entire new um, car with a black interior for that. So that's gonna wait but it kind of sucks that this happened. But anyways, let's um, try and get this off. Alright guys, so it is about a half hour later, and um, I finally got it off. Um, there's a lot of different things holding it in. So there's a Torx bit holding it in right here. And then you have to take, um, where's the piece? This piece off. And there's a little, like, there's a weird thing right here that holds it in. You have to, like, twist it. And then there's two down here, one here, and one here. And then you just have to, like, rip it off. Now... There's still glass in the door. I don't know how to get that out. And um, I need to figure out how to actually get this off because the window goes down into here and I don't actually know how to get this piece off. So I have to look that up real quick. So I'm gonna try and figure out how to get this piece off and then I'll throw you guys back on. All right, so I got that piece off and I ended up just having to pry it off, but you can see all the glass. Let's see if I can get a good angle. Oh. Can't really even see it on camera. Oh yeah, you can. You can see all the little white shit and the blue shit. Yeah, there's a lot of glass in there. You want to vacuum it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> in the meantime, while she does that, Rena is um. Tinting my taillights, or fully tinting them. Oh my god, they look so good. I'm so happy. They look amazing. I, it up a few, but... I don't care. It still looks really good. Bye. Much better than anything I could ever do. Now this is fully tinted. It looks so much better fully tinted instead of just one red and one black. My car is so dirty. It needs to be washed. I didn't even realize how dirty this is. It's a happy, dirty car, though. Alright, so she, she just finished cleaning it, vacuuming it, or no you didn't, she needs to get a smaller piece <laughs> to fit it in all the way in the door. There's glass all over the ground too. There's glass all in there, from that corner. Oh yeah. In the open, vacuum? Yep, yeah. if you open it or pick it up. Yeah. There may be a thong in there too. A thong? That's a lot of glass. Where's the thong? <laughs> Damn, Daniel. Damn, Daniel. Looks so much better. All right, come here. There we go. All right, so it's sometime later, and um, after figuring out, I needed to unscrew. There's a little screw back here. This is what holds the window. It just basically like opens it up so the window can sit in there, and then you tighten it again, and it clamps down on the window. I'm not sure if there's one on this side. There's literally nowhere you'd be able to access it from. Maybe from here. Let me open this up. Alright, so um, there's nothing back here. What are you saying? Are these different tints? No. They're the same. Why? One is orange and one is red. That's just the whites. Why are they like that? Because those are LEDs and those aren't. It's fine. I still like them. This one's been on longer. Yeah. This one's probably faded. 
but yes so i need to get this in here i got the window somewhat in i need to just put it down push it down more why are you whimpering <laughs> what <laughs> what are you doing This is what I have to deal with. <laughs> Alright guys, so we got the window in a little bit and it ended up getting stuck on a piece. And um, we've been trying to get it out for like the past hour. And it's just not working. I took all my weather stripping out because I thought it was getting stuck on that, but it's not that. And I ended up ripping my chrome strip off because I don't want them anyway. I was going to do a chrome fleet eventually anyway. Um, so that's broken. But it is stuck on a piece, and we can't pull it up because, like, it's glass. It's You can't really get a good grip on it. So we're trying to find something to, like, suction cup onto it to pull it up. Because it needs to be pulled up and then yanked out a little, and then it should slide down right into this little piece right here. And then this, there's a screw on the other side that clamps down on it. And then it should be good to just work. And then we can put everything back together. But um, we're just trying to find something to pull it up with. All right, guys, so we need to go and get, like, some sort of suction cup to try and get this window out. What are you brawling about? Are you breaking my tools? No, your thing closed. Oh, but yeah, we need to get some sort of suction cups, and um, we're going to get her some LED brake lights because her shit's be mad dark. And, like, you can barely see them, and we don't want her to get pulled over, so we're going to get LED ones. Mine are full LED, but they look really good, especially on camera. But, um, we're very proud of Rena. You just okay, need to, I did this too. yeah. You need to just um Don't get a. Uh, it looks like shit. <laughs> no, no, it doesn't. Interior ones. Um, but um. I tried that. It looked like I couldn't do it. We should plasti dip these um black, and then maybe get a darker license plate cover. Why? So it's all dark. It look it would look really good, and if we tint it, it would look really good from the back. And you need an exhaust. Because you have no exhaust now because we just cut it off. <laughs> but um, Marina wants me to show you. She did all my interior. Oh, my, my car is such a mess. But she did all this. So all this is carbon fiber now. It looks shitty on camera, but it's better in person. She also did this. I need to get something to tape this because this is, this is really annoying. And then I'm also going to be taping this black this is why this is here because as you can see the park reverse neutral drive support i would make it look like a manual even though it's not a manual i know it's stupid but um let's head on over to um auto zone we need to clean this mess up i need to take this out and then clean up all my tools and then we're gonna see if the people at auto zone um will even be able to help me with it because I told you I really don't have much experience with doing windows and I kind of want it done for tomorrow because I, I work tomorrow and I need my car for work. This window is so dirty from all the fingerprints. We tried to spray it with WD-40 because we thought it was just stuck on something and I just needed to slide in more but it's actually sitting on, piece of a, on a piece of metal so we're going to see what we can do.